Government has released 15 million cities feeding grants to 42 colleges of education to pay for the several months of arrears. The Get Fund Administrator, Sam Gaba, says this investment would begin in the next few days. The Vice President's touching base campaign tour of the Central Region took him to Asin Fusu College of Education, expectedly. The expectedly. The students were very clear in their demand, restore teacher training allowances and pay our feeding grant. Government has come under a barrage of criticisms over the scrapping of the teacher training allowance. Vice President Kwesi Misa Arthur downplayed calls by the opposition MPP that the NDC has no agenda for teacher training institutions. The feeding grant has also been made a responsibility of the GET Fund and the GET Fund has actually transferred the money to the ministry. The ministry is now disbursing it. He announced that government has released 50 million cities for the payment of the feeding grant for all the 42 colleges of education. The vice president reiterated government's commitment to improve educational standards. Our government looking in the future, wanting to expand access to many more students, decided that if we saved money from the Alawa will be able to open up the place admission for many people, resulting from which we have increased the admission to colleges of education. Get Fund Administrator Sam Gaba expressed disappointment at criticisms at the fund's management, noting it has done better in the last eight years. The Vice President later commissioned a one-story classroom block for the Bria Boa Senior High School after he met the Sinfosu chief who called for government intervention in some developmental projects. The Vice President later addressed a rally at the Rollins Park at the Sinfosu where he urged supporters of the NDC to be vigilant on election day after he introduced the NDC parliamentary candidate for the Asin Central constituents, Dr. Kofi Blankson, to the supporters. 